Hey guys, Whitney here with All Things Automotive. Thanks for checking out this video. Today I'm going to be bringing you a 2021 Jeep Compass Limited. It's going to have right around 45,000 miles on it, just under. Um, so again, a 2021 with just under 41,000 miles. It is the Limited. So you're gonna have the leathered seats, heated seats, heated steering wheel. I'm gonna go over all those great features with you as we make our way around this vehicle. Um, then we'll go around again, noticing any sort of dents, dings, or imperfections you could expect to find on this vehicle as it is pre-owned. You will see here you do have the nice shiny black. Um, you're going to have the silver chrome accents on it here to give it a nice pop as well. Um, so starting here in the front, you can see that you do have your fog lights down below. Again, they're going to be outlined in that chrome to give them a nice pop of color and make them stick out. Same thing here with your wheels. We do guarantee three quarter tread or better on all tires here at All Things Automotive. We'll give you exact tread depths once you make our way inside the passenger seat and take a look at the uh, sign off sheet by the mechanic. Looking here on the outside of your mirrors, you are going to see that you have your turn signal indicators, which is a nice safety features for um, those cars that are going to be around you. You do also have your blind spot monitoring here as well. Taking a look, at your door handles, you can see that you do have the proximity lock, so you will never have to take your keys out of your purse or your pocket. Simply have them on you, come up, push the button, and you'll be able to lock or unlock your vehicle. As I previously mentioned, you are going to have that leather seating the whole way throughout. You are going to see here that you have that nice stitching, which is almost like a goldish yellow color, um, which gives it again a nice pop of color. Taking a look over here at your door, you'll see that you do have that same sort of stitching. You will still have your powered locks and your powered windows here. As I had mentioned before, you'll have that sign off sheet that is in the glove box of all the vehicles. Tread depths for your tires, you are at 10 30 seconds in the front, 8 30 seconds in the rear. Brake pads, you are at 15 and 13 30 seconds. So, not having to worry with any of that general maintenance anytime soon, everything is good to go. Take a look here in the back. You will see that again, you'll have that leather seating, plenty of leg room back here. Um, so with those back seat passengers, you will have a center console here that will fold down. It does store two cup holders in there. So if you're not utilizing that middle seat, you will have those additional cup holders there. I will point out that you do have cup holders in both of the doors. Um, so that's not an issue there either. You will also have your powered windows back here. Taking a look at that center console area, just to show you that you do have your charging point port as well as an electrical outlet. You also have on the back of both of your seats storage compartments. So if there's anything that you need to put in there, you will have plenty of space to do so. Making our way around the back here, you will see again that it is a limited edition. I'm um, giving you lots of extra features. One of those is going to be the powered lift gate. So simply push on that button up under there and it will lift itself. You will also see back here that you have your um, backup sensors as well. You do also have the backup camera, so double um, safety features there. Taking a look here in the back, you will see you have plenty of space as far as um, storage is concerned. So whether it is with luggage or groceries, you'll have plenty of room back here. Now, simply push this button and that lift gate will put itself down. We'll take a quick look here inside the back driver's side. Again, just noting um, the space that you do have. You'll still have that center cup holders. I mean, everything is identical to the other side. Super clean vehicle. Um, just a few uh, little cosmetic issues as far as the interior is concerned, but nothing that um, would be of concern. On the driver's side here, you will see that you do have your uh, powered seating arrangements here. So front, back, up, down, and lumbar support. Over here in your door, you are going to have your powered locks, powered windows, and your mirrors. Right inside here, you'll have all of your light options, and I'm just gonna go ahead and hop in here and turn it on. It is a push to start, so simply push your foot on the brake and push the button. On your steering wheel here to the left, you're going to have all of your Bluetooth options as well as your display options up here. On the right, you're going to have all your cruise control settings as well as um, your adaptive cruise control. Taking a look up here, you will see 44,746 miles. I'm gonna go ahead and buckle my seatbelt so that way that light goes off. And then I will also take off the parking brake 
so that goes off. So now you'll notice that there are no lights on in the dash. Everything is set up and good to go. You do have a nice touch screen display here. I just want to point out a couple of things. So as far as your um, heated seats, so here it just shows your heated seats and your heated steering wheel. You'll have all your Bluetooth options here, um, AM, FM, Sirius XM radio capabilities here. And then again, as I had pushed on before, all your climate control options are going to be down here. Now, if you do not want to utilize this space for your climate control, you can always use all of these buttons down here if that's what you are more familiar with. Showing down here that you can set um, kind of like your drive modes. You can do a four-wheel drive lock. You can say whether you're driving in the snow, sand, mud. So you definitely have all your drive control options here. You do have, again, some charging ports. All your drive modes right here. Your automatic start your parking brake and your traction control now the vehicle does come with two keys just to point out here that it will say two of two you do have remote start which is shown right here and then obviously your trunk there two cup holders and a nice little storage area in here one thing I will show you is the Carfax history report just showing no accidents or damages reported on the vehicle and that it was a rental for 10 months now some people are scared of rentals the vehicle is going to go over well has gone through on um, the pa state inspection oil change and um we have checked it from top to bottom so as far as like smells or anything like that coming from the vehicle i know that's a concern with rentals this vehicle does not have any of that there's no sort of smoke odors anything um, so I would definitely say that that fear can be put aside with this particular vehicle. So just on that note, we're going to make our way around the vehicle, pointing out any sort of dense things or imperfections you could expect to find on this particular vehicle. Now, stone chipping is going to be a common thing on all pre-owned vehicles. If you are driving your vehicle, you are going to get some stone chips. So you'll see that there are some just right up here. Again, nothing major. Um, I have went over this vehicle a couple times. Overall, it is actually in very good condition. Um, it is a black vehicle, so it is gonna show a little bit more than most, but I'll be honest, it's really in good shape. As far as your tires here, not really any sort of like curb rashing other than just the little spot right here. Making our way back through here. A little one here and then right here this rim is in good condition there's just a little a little bit of discoloration right here now a lot of your damage will typically come in the back as far as like putting items into and out of the back of the trunk space I will say the only thing that I noticed is this little mark right here as far as the back of this particular vehicle. So overall, again, in really good shape. There is a little scuff right down here that you can see. Again, just pointing this out that it's in good shape. The little mark right here. And again, this one is in good condition. So overall, Great vehicle, great condition, 2021 um, limited, 45,000 miles. If this is something that you could be interested in, please give us a call, 717-485-4224. Check us out online at www.allthingsautomotive.com or come down and visit the showroom, 21518 Great Cove Road in McConnellsburg, Pennsylvania. Thanks, guys. Have a great day.